kind of gross outside today. Can you guess what my favorite band is? So Linkin Park has a new album coming out next month, and they've released one single called Guilty All the Same, which I quite enjoyed. Um, but later today, they're releasing another single from this upcoming album. So I think it's debuting on BBC's Radio 1. So I'm going to tune in and give it a listen. I'm just uploading yesterday's vlog right now, and it came to 2 minutes and 57 seconds. It's not very long. Uh, I always wonder how, like, Charles Trippy's vlogs are consistently 10 plus minutes long. How does he always have that much interesting stuff to put in a video every day? In other news, there's the I ran the Color Me Rad run a few days ago. And there have been a few times when I just sort of mistakenly referred to it as the Color Run, which I didn't know was actually a thing. So there's Color Me Rad and The Color Run, and they are two separate organizations who basically do the same thing. Um, I have discovered that The Color Run is doing an event here in Missoula in September, so I'll probably do that, because it was fun doing Color Me Rad, and I want to do it again. September 20th. The Color Me Rad Run started up here at this baseball stadium and did kind of a loop in this area. The Color Run starts on the university campus. Um, it leaves the campus for a little bit to go up this way, but then most of it takes place right on campus. So I just listened to the debut of Linkin Park's Until It's Gone, and my initial review is I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. It was okay. Everything that's been said by people who have had sneak peeks of this record uh, indicates that it's going to be the heaviest Linkin Park record to date. And this particular song felt... me. It felt like something off of their Minutes to Midnight album, which for me uh, is my least favorite Linkin Park album. But maybe it'll grow on me after I've listened to it a few more times. We'll see. Subable update, we're at 6% of the monthly funding goal. One of the first things that I do when I wake up is check my subable account to see if we've gotten that extra little percentage point. Uh, so today it was loading and I was like, did we get it? Did we get it? And it came up and said six and I was like, yeah! For everybody who is subscribed on subable, thank you very much. Um, you're helping me toward my goal of just making videos for you guys full time. If you're not subscribed on subable, you should come join the party. We have cake. There isn't actually cake, but there are a ton of other fun perks. I've gotten a good handful of questions from people over the last few months asking how they can get a job where I work. And I have good news for you today. We have a job opening for an assistant editor. So if living in Missoula is a thing that you either already do or a thing that you wouldn't mind doing, and you have skill as an editor, then uh, you'll find a link in the description to this video to that job listing. Um, I don't know how long it'll be open, uh, so jump on it quickly if that's a thing that you want to do. Oh kitty, you look crazy. Well, I didn't do much other than stare at a computer screen all day today, and that's not very exciting, so sorry if this was boring. Sometimes my life is boring. Most of the time my life is boring. Tomorrow we're filming more Crash Course and SciShow though, so that should be exciting. Maybe. Right, cat? Right. Well, I'll see you tomorrow, probably.